matter is, is we moved one million people out of this city in one day. We had zero fatalities. We kept all of our hospitals open and clear. We handled 797 automobile accidents. We only had 14 major accidents. And we sheltered 400 kids and got them back to their family today. And none of that was reported. And so, Hartsville Jackson a Airport is continuing to operate. So let now me, it's fair. It's fair to okay. talk about what's on the interstate. And when I leave here, I'm going to help feed folks who are stuck on those cars on the interstate. But I think it would be fair of CNN to point out that I do not have jurisdiction over the highways uh, in the that, city of that's Atlanta fair. and never have. I, I'm happy to point that out. But obviously the, the problem seemed to at least, again, I said, you know, we're talking to people at bus depots, et cetera, schools in Atlanta, uh, the, the children had to spend the night. I mean, this was something that extended both within the city limits and outside them. And you tweeted, sir, yesterday morning, quote, Atlanta, we are ready for the snow. For useful numbers and information, make sure you read our press release. Um, that's right. Do you, and do you in retrospect, hours, feel and that that tweet hours, was a little off? And, and 24 hours later, if you put up the images of the city right now, the city, after a severe storm weather event, is functioning and 80% of our streets are clear and zero fatalities occurred. And we handled 797 incidents and got all of the children in the APS school home. So the answer is we can always get better. Um, I certainly want the people who are stranded on the highways and interstates to get home to their families. And that's why I have on my coat, because that's where I've been. I'm going back there when, when I'm done. But I've sat and watched all day long, you all show image after images of interstates that aren't in the city limits and that aren't the responsibility of the city. And the only name that you all have used all day long is the city of Atlanta when you could have easily put up your cameras and shown the images so, of our city, so which are, with, with the streets being improved and the, and the city moving. And, 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 and let me ask you just a question then before we go on that front, because obviously yes, a lot Aaron. of people who live in your city and use your city use those interstates. So sure, uh, to them, right. all those things are, are tied together, right? You don't know when you cross fair. the city line. So is it the governor's fault that the interstates have, have created this, this, this horrible image and horrible experience? No, Aaron, I think rather than play the blame game, we have shared responsibility. But I want to state clearly, I don't have jurisdiction to clear interstate highways in the city of Atlanta. I'm responsible for the streets that are in the city of Atlanta. And as of today, one day into a severe weather event, we got our streets cleaned, we kept our hospitals open, we kept our people safe, and the city of Atlanta is running again.